what I see happening with young people in my own district and around the country really gives me a lot of hope. It tells me that something is going on that we need to listen to and learn from and support. In order to improve race relations in America, we must speak up. Comfortable silence has gotten us nowhere. The reason we fall back into silence about things that matter is because we are comfortable with it. So in order for us to speak up, we must replace comfortable silence with dis verbal discomfort and we must take action. What have you done as a congresswoman to make sure that we live in this country and we have jobs and we're okay? Each and every day I'm trying to one, change the laws that are causing the, the racist policies that have been perpetrated over the years. Secondly, I'm working every day to bring resources away from the Pentagon, which has a huge budget, into my community to create jobs here in Oakland and in the 13th District. I'm working every day to do that. At this point, um, I want to call out all the youth to uh, step out into that uncomfortableness. It's okay to be uncomfortable. It's okay to uh, shake while you talk. Put, put what you want to say out there because you're, you're never going to do it. You're never going to have the opportunity ever to do it again. Three strikes would end up incarcerating black and brown young men for nonviolent offenses. No one believed that that was an example of institutional racism. You couldn't say this is a racist policy. You couldn't say that this is going to negatively impact people of color because the reaction was unbelievable. I, I said that, of course, and, and I was accused of playing the race card. And one thing I think we have to get clear, I think, as we embark upon uh, this whole struggle to sweep race from under the carpet is to really not allow people to say we're playing the race card if we want to talk about race. You know, because you can't let that happen. Right now, in, in my school, uh, in the classes that I'm in, which are the higher track classes, I've seen that there's a great disparity of um, whites versus minorities in those classes and I think that's very wrong and I want to help work with that and help change um, that in, in education so I was wondering what are some good ways to get started with that. Organize your, your own classmates, the, the ones you see that are, um, are struggling, the ones that um, are angry just, are, uh, just like you um, and, and cause a ruckus. You know, let them know that, that you're not standing, standing idle no more. You know, uh, organize, bro, organize.